Howdy, howdy everyone. I'm Amit from Mail Smartly. Today in this video, you will learn how you can add an attachment in Microsoft Outlook application. So I have covered four main segments in this video, which are how to insert file attachments in Outlook. Second one is how you can attach Outlook items as attachment. And the third one is attach business card in an email. And the last and the fourth one is how you can attach calendar to an email. In every segment, there are multiple different angles I have covered in this video. So without wasting time, let's dive in and understand step by step process. So the first segment is insert file attachments in Outlook. I have created three separate methods. The first one is by attach file feature. The second one is by copying and pasting. And the third method is by send to feature. So to begin with, you have to click on the new email, which is available on the top left corner of your screen under home tab. You can also use control N or control shift M to open the new email. Now, when your new email window is open in a separate window, you can check out a message tab here. When you click on it, a section which is include consists of few options. The first option is attach files. When I click on this drop down list, you will see recent items. These are those items which I have already used to attach in my previous emails. These are listed here. If you want to again attach the files from your recent list or your recent items, you can use directly from here. But in this case, I have to use browse this PC. When I click on it, it will take me to the my computer backend files. Here I have to insert my file or insert the attachment here. So I usually use to set the attachment in the desktop. So when I click on the desktop, it consists of my all the files I want to attach. Now simply select your file. And if you have multiple files, you can use your control keyboard shortcut along with the mouse. So it will allow you to select multiple files at a time. Now all the files are added here. You can see the file name. All your files are added here. Now you have to simply click insert button. Now see all your files you have selected are added in the email as attachment. Now the second method is you have to attach the files using copy and paste. For that you have to click on the folder where your files are available. So I just click on my desktop. So I want to add say this PDF and this Excel file. So I simply use control C to copy or I can also use my mouse right button simply hit copy and again go to the new message window here use your control V or you can use your mouse right button now your files are added you can very easily enter the further details and send this email now the third option is attach files as attachments by send to feature now that means if you are working on your system and you have decided to send few files like this and this to your email, you simply jump directly from here by clicking the right mouse button and there is an option send to. You can select this send to and click on this mail receipt. When you click on it, you are redirected. Your subject is already added as a file name. Both the files are also added. And this content is already appears. Your message is ready to send with the following files or link attachments. The name of both the PDF files or any other files you added here will be appear here. And that way you can complete your inputs here. You can change or edit the subject, add additional information here. Simply click on the send button. This is my first segment where you can insert file attachments in Outlook. Now my second segment, which is attach Outlook items as attachments. And this consists of three different methods or three different segments, which is with attach items features, why forwarding. And the third one is automatically attach original email when replying or forwarding. Although I have covered all these topics in a different, different videos on my channel, but I have compiled this entire attachment story in a single video. So if you are watching this video 
from the beginning to the end, you will learn entire information about how you can attach a file in Outlook. So let's get started with the first option. So the first option is add Outlook items as attachment with attach item features. So open your new email, go to the message tab. Again, go to the attach file. Click on this drop down. You will see an option at attach items, which we are talking about here. Now go to the Outlook items, click on it. That will open insert item dialog box. And you will see which consists of all the email addresses which are added in your Outlook application. I have around six to seven email addresses added. So here I have to select an email from where I need to attach a file. So say I want to attach a file from this email address. When I open it or when I expand it, it consists of all the folders here. Now I have to select my inbox. I'm showing as an example to you, you can choose according to your requirement. And again, I want to open this subfolder. When I click on this folder, all the emails available in this folder appears. Now, if I want to add a few emails from here, I can simply select the email using my mouse left button. I can also use control key to select multiple email addresses. And when I have selected these three email addresses, I only have to once check out insert as attachment because we are talking about attachments in this video. So I just want to add these emails as attachment. So my attachment is already selected. Simply hit OK. When I click OK, my email is added as an attachment with my new email. Now I can very easily send the email to my recipient under this method. Now the second method is you can send an email using forward as attachment feature. When you open your inbox, say I want to open this inbox of my email and I want to send this email as well as this email. So I have selected both the emails using my control key and simply go to the home tab in the response section. You will see a small forward more respond actions button. When you click on it, forward as attachment option appears. You can also use your keyboard shortcut, which is control alt F to use this feature. When you click on that, both the emails I have selected will be added in a new email window automatically. Now I can change the email address from the from, add the email address in the to CC BCC subject. I can add the email content in the message board. Simply click on the send button. You can also use this forward feature in your calendar, contact and text as well. I will show you one by one. Simply click on the calendar icon from the navigation panel, which is available on the top left corner of your screen. So I have few appointments added, say this, simply select the date. Now you will see appointment series tab automatically appears. Now in the action section, you have to select the forward, click on the drop down. Now the forward series, click on it and see appointment is added. You can simply add the email address of your recipient. The subject is already added as a file name. You can modify it and simply click on the send button. You can use the same feature in, a, in your contact also. Click on the contact from the top left corner of your screen. Again, select anyone, any contact, or you can select the multiple contact using your control and mouse left button. When you have selected this in the home tab, there is an option share. Under share, you will see forward contact option. When you click on the drop down as a business card or as an Outlook contact. Click on the Outlook contact. Both the contacts are added in the email. Again, you have to enter the email address of your recipient, enter the subject. You can enter the details in the message board and simply click on send button. And you can also use this feature in the task section as well. So I have to select the task. Now I am already in the task section. Select any task. You can select multiple tasks at a time. Now again, go to the home tab. Under respond section, you will see respond action button. Click on here, forward as attachment. When you click on it, now both your task with the task logo, it is very clear, are added as an attachment. 
Now again, you have to enter the email address of your recipient, enter the subject and simply hit send button. That way you can very easily add email, contact, task as well as your appointment or meeting schedule with the email as an attachment. Now the next option is how you can automatically attach original email when replying or forward. So you have to first change some backend settings of your Outlook. So simply click on the file tab, click on options from the left navigation section. Now Outlook options dialog box appears, which consists of few options in the, on the left and few on the right. So click on the mail from the left navigation section which brings some options which are related to the mail option. When you scroll down a little bit, you will see a section which is replies and forward. Now you will check out when replying to a message, you have an option to select any of this option. When replying to the message, do not include the original message, attach original message, include original message text, include an indent original message text, prefix each line of an original message. Here you have to select the attach original message. I am choosing this option because when I want to reply to a specific message, I want the original message to be attached with the mail when I reply. And the same is with the forwarding a message. When forwarding a message, again I have to select the drop down. There are few options also available here. Again click on attach original message. Now, in both the cases, when I reply to a message or when I forward a message, my original message will be attached as original with my email. Simply hit OK and boom. And when I select a specific email from my inbox and I want to reply or forward this email, the, this email originally attached with the reply or forward mail. I will show you how it works. I want to reply this message. So when I select this message, click reply from the respond. See, the original message is already attached with the message. I can create a new email here. I can modify some information from the here. I can change the subject, add other members and simply hit send button. That way I have added my original message when I reply. When I forward this message, see when I again select this message, click on the forward. Again, this message, my original message is added as an attachment with the mail. Again, add some additional information, change the subject, and simply hit send button. These are few options which we have learned in Outlook, how you can attach Outlook items as attachments. Now, the third option is attach business card in an email. Again, we have three segments under this topic which is attach business card by insert business business card feature, attach business card by forward contact feature and attach a business card by forward feature. So let's begin with the attach business card by insert business card feature. So simply click on the new email. Now again, go to the insert tab and here is an option business card under include section. Click on it, click on other business cards and you will see all the contacts which you have added in your contact are visible here. You can change the contact list over here also and select the one you want to add as an attachment. You can select single or you can also use your control key to select the multiple one and simply hit OK. Now see, my contact are very easily added as a VCF file and you can add additional information here. Simply hit send button. That way you can send your business card as an attachment through email. This feature not only works while you are creating a new email. If you are creating a mail while replying or forward, you can also use this feature. These options are also available at that time also. Now the next option is attach business card by forward contact feature. In this method, you have to jump to the contact list. So click on this third option and you are in the contact window here. Now here you need to simply select the contact, say this or this. Now on the home tab, under share section, there is an option forward contact. Click on it and here you will select as a business card. Click on it. See, both the contacts are added in your email as a business card. Now the final feature is attach calendar in an email. So here again you have to click on the new email. Click on the insert tab. Under include section, 
you have check out all the options here but there is an option which is calendar when you click on it send a calendar via email option dialog box appears now the first option is calendar click on this drop down select your calendar which are already saved in your system day range you have to select the day range you can check out by default day range settings here all you can send by today tomorrow next 7 days next 30 days whole calendar or you can also your customized calendar your specified date so i simply select whole calendar i can also check out some options which are under advance and simply hit okay it will take few seconds and my calendar is added as a ICS file. You can add some additional information here and simply click on the send button. This is first method to add a calendar in your email as an attachment. We have covered the entire features how you can attach a file as an attachment in Microsoft email very easily. Even if you are sending a file with an email or you want to send a contact text, calendar, anything. There are multiple angles, multiple methods to add. So we have covered the whole story of attachment in this video. I hope you have learned something new from this video. And if you have really enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe my YouTube channel. And please, please, please don't forget to click on the bell icon so you will never miss out any outlook tips and problem solvers videos I come up with. Thank you and have a nice day.